Hello viewers, we'll be going over WTI crude oil. In this video, we'll be going over my trade idea of the week and the day-by-day -day probability model. So let's start off with the technical analysis. We're currently up 4% on the one-hour chart. We are off of oversold RSI and we have seen the MACD approach to positive MACD. And now we are approaching or seeing signs of the 9 moving average converge onto the 50 moving average, this yellow line. If we extend that further onto the 4-hour chart, we broke through the 200 moving average that was acting as our previous support that dated back to, say, July 31st, and we breached through that level. So now that act as our resistance in the meantime if we reverse higher. As for the RSI, we are still near oversold, and we have seen signs of it converging on the MACD. If we extend that further onto the daily chart, what we have here is we are at near oversold on the RSI and we have now approached to negative MACD territory. So for the moving average, we are bound, we are resting right along the 100 moving average as well as the 150 day moving averages. So that will be our media support. However, if that level does fail, the next possible support will be around the price of $33.90. And that was is based on past resistance levels that date back to all the way of May 21st. And since we're above resistance, that now act as our support. On the other hand, if we do manage to reverse higher, the next resistance will be where the 200-day moving average and the 50-day moving average coincide. And that is around the range of $41.28. So if we do manage to hit that resistance level, that price movement is roughly around 8%, and to the downside to hit support, that is roughly around 12% down. So for the trade idea of the week, I'll be trading USL. For the trade idea, my position size will be less than 1% of my portfolio, and my entry will be $13.54. That is this range right here, where we encounter previous resistance level. So I'll consider that as our support that dated back to April 15th as our past resistance. So as for my sell target, that will be $14.60 and my stop loss will be $13.28. On the other hand, if I were to open a short position, my entry will be $15.10. Around this range where we encounter past support levels and since we're below support that now act as our resistance to the upside and my sell target will be $13.81 and my stop loss will be $15.64. So for the trade idea of the week or I should say the day-by-day -day probability model which is available in the link below so do check it out. As we progress to the fifth day or week of trading we have a 35% chance for to climb between 0 to 5% and to the downside, we have a 53% chance for it to fall between 0 to negative 5.5%. And on the extreme case, to the downside, a 12% chance to fall between negative 5.5% to negative 11%. So if you enjoyed this content, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching.